Many people have been asking me to review things, especially movies. So last night, I went to the opening of The Dark Knight Rises, which is commonly known as the Batman movie. And I'll tell you, it was really terrific. But what was really amazing was the fact that the cinematography, what they did, was incredible. You couldn't have done it three years ago. You couldn't have done it two years ago. The technology was amazing. The movie is really worthwhile seeing. And most importantly, Trump Tower, my building, plays a role. But it really is worthwhile. Cinematography, what they did, great. The press is now talking about Anthony Weiner, he of Weinergate, trying to make a political comeback. Now, I've known him for a long time, and he's not a good person, not a good guy. Then on top of that, this sexual perversion happened. If this guy makes a comeback, it will be one of the great comebacks of all time. I can't believe anybody would vote for this character. He was never good before, and he really turned out not to be good. Anybody so perverted or so stupid to do what he did should not be entitled to a comeback. So hopefully, we've heard the last of Anthony Weiner. The unemployment numbers in this country are really bad. They can range from anywhere from 14 million to 21 million people. Think of it, 21 million people unemployed while China is taking our jobs, while OPEC is ripping us off with oil prices, and that's why you're paying so much at the gas pump. Just think of what's happening to this country. People used to respect us. They don't respect us anymore. They laugh at us. President Obama is asking Mitt Romney to show more tax returns. I would suggest to Mitt Romney that what you should do is go out and ask for college applications, college records, and all of the sealed documents in Chicago that Obama's not showing. If he's going to give his tax returns, and he already has given some, then Obama should unseal all of these records where millions of dollars were spent to keep them quiet, to keep them secret. What are you hiding, Mr. President?